Tonight, the Lake George community is reeling over the loss of Benjamin Osborne. The U.S. Army specialist was killed yesterday in a battle in Afghanistan. Kumi Tucker spoke with his family and his friends tonight. Kumi? Good evening. Osborne's family says he died protecting his fellow soldiers in a confrontation with the Taliban. This tragedy comes so soon after a celebration. He just got married in February. Pride, honor, dedication. 27-year-old specialist Benjamin Osborne began serving in the U.S. Army in 2007. It's something that's in our blood. When, you're, when you walk into a recruiting station, you know what you want. He knew he wanted combat. He knew he wanted the infantry. He chose it. He did a 15-month tour of duty in Iraq. In his second tour, he served in Afghanistan. His mother in Queensbury told us Ben Osborne was a top gunner who died Tuesday in a skirmish. He wanted the, the rest of his brothers and sisters in his unit to know that, you know, he died for them. That's why he jumped behind that machine gun. That's why he was able to, you know, he was able to defend his brothers and sisters. He sacrificed himself from the, for, for them. Flags were lowered at Lake George Junior Senior High School, where Osborne graduated in 2002. He had worked as a bartender at the Lobster Pot, where they said each day he brought smiles and fun to his work. He was a popular, friendly athlete, good at baseball and football. Town Supervisor Frank McCoy, who also knew him, you know, asked uh, for prayers for the family. It's, it's a real honorable thing to sign up for the Army, which he volunteered, and to, you know, to go serve your country. And I, I, hope, I hope everybody respects that and remembers that. Just coming up here, I saw you know, on, on the reader boards, rest in peace. And uh, I, see, I, I expect a lot of flags to be out in Lake George tomorrow. And all around town, there were signs of mourning, flags at half staff yellow ribbons. Osborne's family said he just married a woman from South Glens Falls in February and they honor the man who made the ultimate sacrifice. I'm proud of him. I know, I know I'm deep down. I'm so proud of him. Supervisor McCoy plans to declare a town-wide day of mourning. Back to you, Jim. All right. Thank you, Kumi.